Should you use an anchor tag or a button tag for clickable elements in HTML? There's actually a lot of nuance to this, so some of the answer might surprise you. First, I'm going to assume that we all know that you should not be using divs by default for clickable elements. While it might be tempting, there's a lot of drawbacks. Divs are not focusable, they're not accessible, screen readers will not recognize these as buttons. They do not translate certain keyboard inputs to clicks like space bars or return keys. You could work around some of these things, like adding role equals button, to at least hint to screen readers that this is a clickable element. Tab index equals zero can make the div focusable, but you still won't get support for using the return or space keys for firing the click event, so you'd have to handle that manually too. Overall, there are a lot better options than doing this. For instance, the button tag that handles all of that. It works like any other button in your computer or mobile device. Screen readers understand it. They accept focus. You can use certain keys to trigger clicks as well as a standard click, but they do come with some shortcomings. A challenge I've always had with buttons is styling them. You start applying CSS and they just start looking really bad. The browser tries to force all of this weird styling to these elements and can become a pain to work with. This is why I think many people just opt for a div. It doesn't come with any added baggage, it just works the way you'd expect styling wise. In the past, we used to have to provide a long list of rules to override to the browsers, but modern CSS gives us the new all property where we can use all colon unset to say, hey, disable all of that special styling, treat this like a span style wise. This will give you the full control you want over styling and solve those issues. But there's one more nuance to know about, which is that buttons by default, if they're inside of a form, will try and submit the form when they're clicked. That's also probably not what we want, so you need to add type equals button to button elements to disable that functionality. And this effectively rounds off what a really good clickable element implementation looks like. But what if you want to link to other pages? You could say, oh, I'll just add a click handler and I'll just update the URL in the browser. But this is a very bad idea. This is not crawlable for SEO. This will not behave the way people expect if they do like a command click or a right click open a new tab it's best to avoid buttons for navigation that's where we come back to the anchor tag we can just set an href on the anchor tag and linking works exactly as expected and you may say hey why don't we just add click listeners to anchors and just leave off the href property well anchors without the href property do not behave like buttons they actually are no longer focusable and certain keyboard inputs do not work as expected so you're still going to want to use buttons for clickable elements that don't link to other pages and anchors when you need to have a link to another page so a common solution to make things work across the board is to define your own button components. If it provides an href property, render an anchor tag. And if it doesn't, render a button with type equals button. This is how many modern UI frameworks like Chakra UI or Material UI work. So that you can have a standard simple button component that adapts to the right HTML markup based on if it's given a URL via an href property or an on-click handler. Also note that my examples here are all in React and JSX, but this applies to any UI framework, any HTML. So back to the original question, use a button tag whenever possible for clickable elements. Unless that element is just to navigate to another page, then use an anchor tag with the href property.